go. Okay. This carriage is going to ride over here. Hopefully stop at this spot and pick this stuff up. Doing the thing. Okay. Now it should go back. Back in here. Let's sit there for a minute. Okay, it stops there. Picks up whatever. Then it goes back. The gantry. Not a carriage. Carriage is a style of house. This is a gantry. Alright, stops at the thing, drops off its inventory. We're working. Puts it on the belt. Let's go. Alright, the belt brings it around. Oh, it just disappeared. Why did it disappear? Is it going here? Where did it go? There it goes. Let's go. I think we got it figured out. All right, cool. All right, so I'm messing around with Create, and they added a plan Enigmatica 6 is the mod pack, and they added a thing in here called the Gantry Carriage, which moves along this gantry shaft if you power it, and I'm using it to move items. So I have a mob farm set up, started over here. I'm gonna make a tower of all farms here. As of right now, I just have a blaze spawner in there. I'm gonna add a bunch of different spawners, making a tower here of all the different mobs that I want their drops from. So this gantry carriage is taking inventory out of the drops that are caused from this farm. And it just rides along that rail and goes back and forth and how I created it to go back and forth is there's a redstone, what is this thing called? A redstone contact. And when this contact, I have two on each end and the bottom of that gantry carriage. When the contact touches here, it creates a redstone signal. So then I'm using this redstone link and the redstone link activates a gear shift, which changes the rotation of these shafts, sending it back and forth on each side. Hopefully that makes sense the way I explained it. And I'm powering it with water wheels. I just have three water wheels. One's powering, or the set of three is powering the belt line that's feeding this portable interface that is loading the gantry. And the other one is powering the actual mechanics of the gantry crane itself. So let me drop some stuff in here, show you how it works. So it's only pulling out stacks of 32. I have it set like that right now because it was pulling one at a time as I was testing it. And it brings it along the belt line, boom. Puts it, it doesn't put it into this storage interface, which I might need to add something to change this. I don't know if it's gonna get backlogged once I add more spawners and so on and so forth. But so that gantry carriage will come over, it'll pick the stuff up from this portable interface. And then it brings it back down here it's taking a break. It takes a break for 40 seconds on each side because that's how I have it programmed on those gear shifts. And then when it passes by this portable interface, it'll drop the stuff off onto there. And then that feeds a belt line that I have down here. Turn this hover on. That feeds this belt line right here. And then the belt line then wraps around top of the base here and it goes into this chest. And then that chest goes into the drawer controller and it feeds the drops into the drawers. So I just wanted to share what I have so far. Thanks for checking out the video, y'all. Have fun and peace.